Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I just have to forgive a little bit of extra noise in the background. Um, we're here down in Adelaide at the Adelaide Botanical Gardens and we're just standing opposite Cascade, which is one of the pieces from Expo done by Sergio Fragani. Uh, and it was a piece that was made up of 500 individually cut pieces of glass. Uh, and we'll do a second in YouTube in a little minute uh, in relation to the actual sighting uh, at Expo uh, and how it worked. But here in Adelaide, this actual pool structure, where it's currently situated, uh, was actually designed by Sergio. Uh, and it's also got a Providence plaque that it was from Expo 88, which is good to see. And it is just opposite the Bicentennial Hothouse here in, uh, in the Adelaide Botanical Garden. And so with that, I'll just say good morning and we'll be back in a minute for the second part. So in the last part of this YouTube for the first segment on the Cascade, I just thought I'd do a little pan just prior to, there you go, there's the Bicentennial Hothouse. And, and the placement of this piece is vitally important to understand and appreciate, both at Expo, as you'll see by the pictures, after and by the pictures that Sergio has given me in the placement in the Adelaide Botanical Gardens here. So enjoy the following pictures. Peter Racy again from Foundation Expo 88 YouTube and we're back uh, at the Adelaide Gardens uh, with the Cascade from Expo 88 and you can probably see a little bit more clearly now the actual all the individual cut pieces of glass and as I said on my previous YouTube we're going to talk just a bit about the manufacturing uh, of uh, the, the piece it was made out of 500 hand cut individual pieces of glass by Sergio he actually went um, and I've got the actual contract here, believe it or not. Uh, he actually went and made this uh, out of the facility um, in Cooper's Plains. Uh, the uh, Pinkerton AECI operations at Cooper's Plains. And it's six mil glass, each one of those pieces. And Sergio, in his Sydney uh, facility, made up timber templates out of plywood. Uh, it looks like from the photographs that you'll be able to see after the YouTube. Uh, and um, then all cut up and I had spoken to Sergio a couple of times and he tells me that they wasted an absolute incredible amount of glass to get this particular feature and that if they were doing it today with today's technology and today's computer design aids they would have used less than half the amount of glass that they did but it was a world first at the time and it is quite an amazing piece on a beautiful pedestal uh, and it actually is a well worthwhile um, visiting uh, in the Adelaide Botanical Gardens and with that I'll uh, just remind everyone to have a look at the other YouTubes uh, that are um, available uh, and good morning. Thank you.